Hey, what's up YouTube? What's going on out there? Hey, I wanted to make this video, and uh, to be honest with you, this is a video that I never thought I was going to have to make. This is basically going to be my rant at dumbass people, and uh, I'm just going to get right into it. Here's the thing. 99% of you out there that are watching these videos, whether it's truck driving, music, whatever, are decent people. But the problem is there's so many people watching them that that 1% is still a big-ass number. And to those 1% of you that are jackasses out there, this video is for you. About six years ago, now this is May of 2015. About six years ago, in June of 2009, I posted a video up of me in a hotel room uh, talking about what happened to me on my way to Sierra England. Now, at that time, when I made that video, I planned on chronicling my truck driving adventures just like a lot of other guys do out here on YouTube, and it ended up backfiring on me. I never ended up making it to CR England, and uh, you would not believe, to this day, six years later, the bullshit emails and comments that I'm still getting over that video. It just boggles my mind. So, I'm here to tell you that for you idiots out there that still think I'm sitting in a hotel room twiddling my thumbs or sitting at home on my ass trying to figure out what to do <laughs> you're wrong it's six years ago when you watch this shit look at the dates people I mean I like to read the descriptions or, or I mean pretty much a lot of times the title will tell you what the deal is but you know if you're not sure about something wouldn't you think you'd go read a description or, or, or something like that because I know I do but it's been six years and people are still giving me shit over this. Look, I had one guy tell me that I, uh, he left a comment. A lot of them I'll delete. Some of them I'll leave. Some of them that are real bad I delete. But some of them I just read them and, and I'm like, you know, I'm like, whatever. But uh, one guy left a comment saying that, oh, I'm, it's such poor planning on my part and I'm never going to make it in truck driving and blah, blah, blah. Well, obviously, to you, ass bag. I'm sitting in a truck, ain't I? So obviously I did something right, and I've been doing something right since then. And here's the thing. I never wanted to actually go to CR England. I had some uh, rough times getting into the business. It was a way for me to get my foot in the door. I planned on going there, getting experience, and moving on to bigger and better things. Now, I never made it there because of the Greyhound bus. And if you want to watch the video, I mean, if I think of it, I'll put a description or a link to the to the video in the description box below or um, if you want just search my name search my channel you'll find it I mean it's still there I never pulled it but uh, you know it's just unbelievable the amount of bullshit that I'm getting over this video like I said it's six years later and I can't believe I have to sit here and bitch about this you know I mean and again there's a lot of you out there that have been genuine and sent me well wishes and say you hope things work out and to those of you that, that have done that I appreciate that and there are those of you out there who just, you know, have sent me emails wondering what happened and what's going on now. And, and you know, to those people, like I said, I, I appreciate your concern and just the well wishes. And, uh, you know, like I said, it, it's it's genuine and I appreciate it. And I'm glad you take the time to watch my videos, whether you subscribe or not. You know, it's just cool that you're taking the time to watch the stuff I'm putting out here. But, like I said, to those 1% of you that are assholes out there... Get over it and get over yourself because you know what? There are very, very few people out there that can get into this business and survive. And you know what? I'm one of them. And I take pride in what I do and I'm glad to be a truck driver. And, uh, you know what? Like I said, you know, to those of you who, who want to hate me and whatever, I don't give a shit. I'm not out here to make friends. I'm out here to make money. So, uh, you know, that's about it. Um, just to give you a you know, real quick update from here, uh, I'm going to try to get back into the habit of making more videos. It's been a long, long time, and my plan of doing it at the beginning kind of went to shit. So uh, I'm going to try to get back into it. And uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to start off just uh, chronicling what happened since CR England. Um, I'm never going to give company names of where I work currently or probably in the past just because I don't want to go down that road. Because you never know who does watch this stuff out here, so, um, you know. But that's probably the first thing I'm going to do is I'll make a series of quick videos just bringing you up to speed on what I'm doing now. And then uh, there's a lot of things I want to talk about and throw my two cents in that I see other guys out there on YouTube talking about. So, um, 
you know, everything from truck stop safety to parking at night to off the wall things, you know, things I've come across that I've seen and uh, that I think you should be aware of to trainers to, there's all kinds of stuff I want to talk about out there. So, um, anyway, like I said, I appreciate everybody who's watching this. Again, to those of you who were genuine and wishing me well and all that stuff, I appreciate it. To those of you that are assholes and keep sending me bullshit emails and comments, whatever. I can't stop you from doing it, but you guys are the reasons that I think you probably keep YouTube going because if it wasn't for assholes out there, it would be dull. So I guess maybe I should thank you. I don't know. But at this point, I'm sick of your bullshit, and uh, that's the end of it. So again, everybody, thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for a lot of cool stuff I have coming up. Uh, hopefully in the next few weeks and uh, I guess that's about it alright so uh, I'll catch you down the road be safe, be smart, be good and we'll talk to you soon, later